You're learning with 9 to 5 English. Business English for the workplace. Hi, Tim here with another 9 to 5 English lesson. In today's lesson, we're going to learn how to talk about your education. Your education is an important part of your background. And there are lots of situations where you might talk about where you went to school and what you studied. A job interview is an obvious one. But you might also talk about your education in casual conversation. The first thing you might mention is where you went to school. More specifically, people might be interested in which university you attended, and there are several ways we can tell them about that. Firstly, you might just use that verb, attend. Similarly, you could say you went to or graduated from a certain university. Another way to talk about your university is to say that you're an alum of a certain school. Alum is short for alumnus, which is a word that means a person who attended a school. So, for example, I might say, I'm an alum of Columbia University. Let's try practicing some of this language. We're going to give you some examples after each example, try repeating it yourself. Ready? Let's give it a go. I graduated from Yale in 2008. For my undergrad, I went to the London School of Economics. I attended a small technical college in Colorado. I'm an alum of Washington University. Okay, we've practiced some different ways of talking about our university. But another important aspect of your education is what you studied. In English, we call your area of study your major. This word can be used in a few different ways. So, for example, if you studied biology, you could say that your major was biology. But you can also say that you were a biology major. So the noun means both an area of study and a person who studies that area. We can also use major as a verb, such as, I majored in biology. After you tell someone your major, you might also mention an area of focus. For example, within business, you might have focused on finance. Or you might mention your minor, which is like your secondary area of study. And just as we say we majored in a subject, we can say we minored in a subject. There's another, much simpler way to talk about your major. And that's just to say something like, I studied biology. Of course, that's not the only course you took, but people understand that was your major. Now, there's one more way to tell people what you studied, and that's by saying you have a degree in a certain field. Your degree might be a master's degree or a bachelor's degree. And you can use the short form of these, such as an MA or a BS, which means 
Bachelor's of Science, and is used for degrees in technical fields, such as engineering or computers. Let's practice some of these expressions for talking about your major. Once again, you can repeat the examples after you hear them. I studied international business with a focus on finance. I majored in French with a minor in political science. I started out as a science major, but switched to education. I have a Bachelor of Science in Mechanical Engineering. So, we've learned some different ways of talking about your university and your major. But how do these expressions sound in a real conversation? Let's listen to a short dialogue between Tanya and Jose. Tanya is asking Jose about his education. So, did you go to university around here? Yeah, I graduated from Iowa State University in 2010. Oh, yeah? Great school! What did you study? I majored in business with a minor in statistics. As you just heard, Jose says he graduated from Iowa State University. And when asked about what he studied, he says he majored in business. He also adds that he had a minor in statistics. Now it's your turn to practice. We'll repeat the dialogue, but this time we'll beep out the second speaker's words. You will have to say those parts yourself. Remember to start by saying that you graduated from Iowa State University. Then you can say that you majored in business and minored in statistics. So, did you go to university around here? Oh, yeah? Great school! What did you study? All right. We've learned some great ways to talk about your education, including what university you attended and what you studied. Be sure to tune in next time when we'll learn how to talk about your career. Until then, so long and happy learning.